This is day two for me of a master cleanse. Why am I doing master cleanse? It's a good idea to detox on a regular basis, and the last real detox I did was two and a half years ago. So I think it's fine time that I did another one. And a secondary reason, or maybe it's the primary reason, is to lose some weight. You find that pound upon pound just creeps up on you. Very, very slowly. Very, very slow so as to not be detected. And the people around you don't see the change in appearance. So, you can fool yourself into believing that you look just as good as you did a year ago, or two years ago. And then one day, five years in the future, ten years in the future, you wake up obese. Now, it wasn't all of a sudden thing that happened over years, but you didn't do anything to stop it. So I decided that if I did this kind of harsh, extreme cleanse, I'd have a good chance of getting rid of the pounds, and answer the pounds that I have right now, before a punch, and before obesity steps in. You know, get the problem in the butt. Well, the goal here is 31 days on the cleanse, and I think I can do 31 days. The only thing that's going to shorten this cleanse is if I reach my weight loss goals a lot earlier. If I reach them on day 16, day 17, then I may do a 25-day cleanse. I don't want to lose too much weight. Uh, originally, I was going to do a 40-day cleanse. However, we are planning a family vacation the second week in October, it being September 8th today, and I probably need two or three days to ease out of this thing. So, I realized the maximum number of days that I can do this is 31, possibly 32. Uh, day two, how do I feel? Hungry, I'm not going to lie about that, hungry. Uh, yesterday was the first extreme day because I was changing my patterns from the normal days of going out and getting a salad about 2 o'clock, having a coffee about 4 o'clock, having dinner with my girlfriend around 7 o'clock, all that got shelled. Yesterday, I found that a lot of my social outlets, getting out of the house, going out and doing things, came to an end because I was no longer eating. And that transition was hard. Getting by without eating, not that hard for one day, probably not that hard for three days. I've done this before. Three day fasts, not an issue. I think it's going to start to get harder after today. Days three and four, people warn me are very extreme, very hard. And I also think that uh, as I rid my body of these uh, toxins, a lot of those toxins are going to bring back some sort of emotional memory, that's what they say. And so those days may be quite hard. I'll let you know when I get there. But so far, not too bad. I weighed myself today and I apparently lost two kilos since. I think it's impossible to lose two, two kilograms in a day. That must be the result of a lot of water weight loss. Uh, I'm recording all my weights each and every day, taking a frontal shot and a side profile shot, and I'm going to put all these up. I'm done with I'm going to do these video updates sporadically. I realize that if I did them every day, no one's going to watch them. People are going to get bored. But if I do them, let's say, every six days, maybe every eight days, or maybe I do like three video updates, the whole entire cleanse, that's something that people might watch. And I think I'll have more to say if I reveal my recollections over a series of days rather than every day. I may not notice the changes every day, but I may notice the changes over a seven day period. So this is day two. I'm trying to hang in there. I'll keep you posted on, I don't know, day 10, day 12.